Hello my beloved. The world I see holds nothing that I want. Do you believe this? I tell you my, my sweetheart. And you are my sweetheart. Because in you the brother I recognize who I am. And we are one in God. Senses. In this joy, in this oneness, in this beauty lies all liberation and healing. We are one in the Father. And all the treasures of God are ours. We are love. We are the extension of love. Love gives us everything we want. God has given himself to us. Can you imagine? So how can the world of limitations, of anxiety, with no cause, but the cause of the insane idea to be separate from the source of love, of life, of peace, of joy, give us anything. Just make it very clear, this world is made up, made up for suffering, for death, for separation. The whole purpose of the world is death, suffering. The purpose of the world is suffering. How can I <laughs> look in this very world for satisfaction, for fulfillment? No. This world is a denying of who we are. So we have to let go of this world and open our hearts, minds, and open the wings and fly back home where we are in truth. And nobody, my beloved, nobody has ever left the Father. Nobody, the creation of the Father is still in the love arms in the heart of the Father. And that's where we are. This world we made up is just a dream of hate, of anxiety, of death, suffering, sickness, disease. So how can you find joy in this kind of world? The world was nothing, holds nothing that I want. And I tell you honestly, when you just once and might it be a, sm a little moment experienced and sensed the tenderness and the love of the Father who so much surrendered to you as, you, your tre uh, as his treasure, his holy child. There's nothing, 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 nothing which can give you that satisfaction and fulfillment. The Father knows who you are. The Father knows who I am. And that's it, what I want to be. I forgive the Father all the false gods I invented. And I forgive my brother, my projections. And I see beyond all the forms that I projected, I made up. There are no men in the women. There's only one holy child of God the Christ, the Holy Self. Yes, my Holy Self is all I want. I am my own aim, but I find myself in you. Okay, let us start a beautiful lesson. I just love it. Lesson 128. Yes. One is a father, and two means one and one is two. I am one with the Father and eight is eternal life. I just play around with numbers. Lesson 128. The world I see holds nothing that I want. Absolutely. I'm so fulfilled. I'm happy. I'm the, I'm the beingness. I'm the oneness. I'm that who I am. Created by the Father. And I've never lost my true identity. So all we search is us. We search ourselves. So the whole cause is practically a love letter to myself to come back to who I am. The world I see holds nothing that I am. The world you see holds nothing that you need to offer you. Nothing that you can use in any way, nor anything that at all serves to give you joy. No. Believe this thought and you are safe from years of misery, from countless disappointments, and from hopes that turn to bitter ashes of despair. No one but must accept this thought as true. 
if you would leave the world behind and so beyond its petty scope of little ways and little ways. Each thing you value here is but a chain that binds you to the world, absolutely. So heaven is mine, so what? The whole heaven, God is mine, and it will serve you no, uh, serve no other end but this. For everything must serve the purpose you have given it until you see a different purpose there. The only purpose worthy of your mind this world contains is that you pass it by without delaying to perceive some hope where there is none. Be you deceived no more. The world you see holds nothing that you want. It's a very, very clear this statement. The world you see holds nothing that I want. Escape today the chains you place upon your mind when you perceive salvation here. For what you value you make part of you as you perceive yourself. Money, beauty, intelligence. Now forget about it. I am not a be human being. I am the unlimited Holy Son of God. All things you seek to make your value are greater in your sight limit you to you further. Hide your verse from you and add another bar across the door that leads to true awareness of yourself as capital letters of my true self. Let nothing that relates to body thoughts delay your progress to salvation. Not permit temptation to believe the world holds anything you want to hold you back. Nothing is here cherished. Nothing is here to cherish. Nothing here is worse one instant of delay and pain, one moment of uncertainty and doubt. The worthless offers nothing. Certainty of worse, certainty of worse cannot be found in worthlessness. So nothing which is perishable has any worse. Only the unperishable, the gifts of God, have any worse. They fulfill me. Today we practice letting go all sort of value we have given to the world. Money, intelligence, fame, name, whatever. Forget about it. This planet is such a tiny little spot in the whole universe, and I am the heaven. I am the heaven, the extension of the Father, the whole. Today we practice letting go all sort of value we have given to the world. We leave it free of purpose. We gave its aspects, and its phases, and its dreams. We hold it purposeless with, within our mind. So we open up all the things we have to renew and better and change in the world. No, nothing is here and loosen it from all we wish in it were. Thus do we lift the chains that the bar, uh, that, bar the, uh, that bar the door to freedom from the world and go beyond a little value uh, and all little values and diminish goals. So we let the mind just find the way back home. Pause and be still a little while. And see how far you rise above the world when you release your mind from chains and let it seek the level where it finds itself at home. We are only at home in the Father, beloved. There we are, we never left the Father, and there we belong. Just let it be today. It will be grateful to be free a while. Oh, yes. It knows where it belongs, but free its wings and it will fly in sureness and in joy to join its holy purpose. Let it rest in its creator. Yeah. There to be restored to sanity, to freedom and to love. So beautiful to rest for a moment in the Father and to feel the love he has for me. Give it ten minutes rest three times today, and when your eyes are opened afterwards, you will not value anything. No. You see as much as when you looked at it before. You will not value anything you see as much as when you looked at it before. Your, per your whole perspective of the world will shift just a little every time you let your mind escape its chains. 
The world is not where it belongs, and you belong where it would be, and where it goes to rest when you release it from the world. Your guide, the Holy Spirit, your guide is sure. Open your mind to Him. Be still at rest. Yes, beyond the world of form, we are in the Father. Protect your mind throughout the day as well as when you think you see some value in an aspect of an, ima an image of the world. No beautiful sunset landscape. Relations, no, forget about it. My holy relation with every mother is only in the Father. A fuse to lay this chain upon your mind, but tell yourself with quiet certainty. This will not tempt me to delay myself. The world I see holds nothing that I want. So anything we see, we liked in the past as a substitute for the love of God and the beautiful Holy Self we are, the Christ. We just say, this will not tempt me to delay myself. The world as he holds nothing that I want. Beyond all the forms we projected, we made up men and women, children, plants, animals. Just hear the, the request for love and liberation, for forgiveness. And join with the brother and the unlimited, unlimited light we are, the Holy Self. The Holy Self. I'm a home in the Father as a whole. As a whole. I'm not in this body. Bound. No, 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 no. Ah, what a lesson, what a liberation. Be where you are. Be where you are. It was wonderful. The 10 minutes I just was flying back home. And I'm still there. Yes, Jesus, I feel our oneness. My wholeness, my oneness. How can I search anything in the world? We are all back home. I feel you now, brother, I am one with you. What a beauty, what a release from limitations, from shame. To feel that oneness with you, my brother, gives me all fulfillment, all satisfactions, and we are home. Let this sensation come in your mind, and you know. This world holds nothing, nothing, nothing that I want. I only want you, Father, and my Holy Self, which I share with you and everyone. Nothing else. I'm unlimited. I'm the beauty. I'm the unlimited child of God. I'm the whole. And in my wholeness, love doesn't leave anyone out. I feel all the fulfillment. So I need everyone. I embrace the whole false creation I made up and let it vanish in the light of love. That's forgiveness coming back home to the true Holy Self we all share. Have a beautiful day, my love. Enjoy it to be free and let it be done, my Holy Spirit, that you are already saved, healed and whole. Beautiful, in the Father, right in the love arms of the Father, together with me. Yes, we are one, we are one, we are one for eternity. I love you.